in real life video today and I am unboxing my creative art box for February so this is the box and uh, I was trying to see if they were gonna have March boxes and uh, April as well because I am doing this for my patron and thanks to my, pa my patrons are I'm able to subscribe um, to this box so I don't know I didn't see anything for the, co the coming month so I may have to change up the box the subscription to something else um, or I will just stick with regular canvas and paints I have to restock my acrylic paints but um, anyway let's get to the unboxing of the box <laughs> I know it's early but let's see oh and I thought I cut all this tape but I didn't and I don't have my knife with me but all right once I missed all these sides of tape I hope you're having a wonderful week it's been a very strange week for me I feel like I have not done a lot but I actually have all right I'm not sure what that is. I'm just showing it to you. What is this? So I'm gonna grab the biggest item, of course. How to draw and paint. Color. Learn to choose, use, and mix colors. Mixing a variety of colors, learning basic color schemes, applying color formulas, creating color harmony. So this is the first item that I grabbed. And let's see. So it is, um, ooh, has examples of paintings and I'm not sure what type of colors they're using. It almost seems like watercolors, but this is a guide, so it's gonna be pretty interesting. Actually, um, going to read this because I find it um, very helpful. Um, Sometimes I, I don't really have a hard time combining colors, but um, this will give me an idea of a little bit of a different perspective um, for colors. Ooh, so this is an example of what it looks like inside. So I'm excited to read this. It was squished in there, but... All right, let's see what else comes with. So it comes with a list of items that the box comes with. I'm not gonna read it or it's gonna be too long and boring. Oh, there's not a whole lot today. So there's two um, pieces of paper. I'm assuming these are to paint on. And there's a sticker. Born to Sparkle. It's a little bit um, uneven, but that's okay. It's a sticker. And there's these inside here. I don't know what it is. Ah, what is this? Okay, so, I don't know, I have a feeling that somebody else is packaging this because it's just arranged differently. So I have Faber-Castell um, magenta color, this is a pencil, so, oh, focus. Somehow you can kind of see it right there. All right, so that's one. Then I have warm gray. Hi, how's it going? Then I have dark yellow. Can 
kind of hard to focus on it. Then there is this coloring brush pen, Koi. So it's water-based. Okay, cool. So this is how it looks like. I should have grab the paper. Let me see. I can just use it here. So let's see how it writes. I'm gonna grab this box right here. Um, ooh. It's a pretty color. So that's how it looks. The color is pretty. I like that. Then I'm not sure what this watercolor marker. It's a very strange marker. I've never seen one like this before. So it has a fine um, um, line part. Maybe this is the thicker one. Yes for thicker lines I cannot English I should do a review in Spanish sometime let's see how this works oh my god <laughs> lemon jello tono de amarillo limón so it's lemon So it's a little bit uh, towards green. It's cute. I like that color. So this is a very interesting uh, combination of items uh, so far because this book, it almost seems like it was gonna come with watercolor or acrylic or something like that. But so far it's been pencils and markers. And I have another uh, pen right here is Aqua Pen Graphics. What was that? What was that about? It's an email. Thanks for following me. Oh, thanks for following me. <laughs> All right, so this is an Aqua Pen Graphics. So that we have the fine and the brush. So this is the fine part of it. And then brush, which is a thicker one. So I'm a little bit confused on what the theme of the box is. Now let's see the color of this one. So this is a fine wine, the fine wine, the fine one. <laughs> oh, the struggle. I should go back to bed. Hey, thanks. So I have a little bit of everything in this channel. Right now I'm doing in real life. So these markers are actually pretty cool. And then lastly, I have an actual brush. Okay. So the mystery is um, to find out what the theme of it is. This, I'm confused because I was expecting, like I said, watercolors because of the book and I have pencils and markers and one brush for something i mean i can think of um dipping the brush in the water and um kind of diffuse the color with the for the um pencils i have done that before so it looks really cool um you can use it with um pens as well with um ink pens I will have to show you a drawing. Uh, I will do that eventually. And you can also do it with just regular pencil. Just uh, put the brush in water and dip it on. And you can fade it and blend it. So it's really cool. So let's see the list. So I'm confused. Let's see. So one Walter Foster how to use color book. Check. And this is supposed to be $8.95. One Princeton art brush, check. And that was supposed to be a dollar fifty. Three Faber Castell watercolor pencils. Okay, so that makes sense. 
So these are going to be able to be um, faded with the water. I mean, they should have put a little um, container for water, but that's cool. I don't, I don't mind, but it would have been a little bit helpful, especially if you're a beginner, you know, you don't know. You don't have a lot of ideas on how to do things. So three of these, and the total of these is 855. Then Sakura Koi coloring brush pen which is this one, 249. Marabu Graphics Aqua Pen. Marabu, is it this one? Yes, this, this is the one. Bob Ross, yes. I actually gave my mom a Bob Ross pop, which is awesome. <laughs> She was used to watch Bob Ross all the time. I mean, I was used to watch it too because of her, and uh, it was fun. Happy clouds. There's a squirrel on the tree. And uh, it came with a little, um, not a squirrel, but it came with a, what's it called? Mapache in English. Oh my God, raccoon. <laughs> so it, it was funny, but. I didn't take pictures of the Bob Ross or my mom's reaction because my mom doesn't live here. She lives in Mexicali. So that was fun. And then, okay, so it comes with two Strathmore uh, cold press watercolor papers. So these are them. Oh my God. <laughs> Happy little trees and the clouds. Oh my God, I have to watch Bob Ross. I have to actually, you know what? I'm probably gonna try to uh, do a painting like that. I'm gonna do a stream and I'm gonna do what Bob Ross does or just put it in my own style. It would be funny. I have to get, um, how do you call them? Um, a stand? I don't know what the name of those are. Sorry, my English is not perfect. But anyway. And the super item, so this is the super item, Windsor and Newton watercolor marker. And this is supposed to be $6. Um, I cannot remember how much I paid for this box because I actually grabbed January and February and that was, that was a total of um, probably 48 to $50. And, um, I don't know if I put the video here. I think I did a Facebook Live video for the other box and uh, it was for uh, manga, which I posted photos of my work on my Patreon and on my Facebook page as well. Um, I'm going to be doing this more on Twitch because I just, um, I figure besides gaming, I should do this more often. And, um, but yeah, so. It ha this list has um, suggestions on how to use the items. So the Princeton art brush for fine detail, mixing and spreading, blending color. You can use a larger brush for backgrounds and well. Note, never dip your markers or pencils directly into water. Use the brush to apply water to paper. That's kind of common sense, but it's a good, good thing that they um, include that. But yeah, I'm, I'm confused on why they haven't... Um, thanks for the retweet or whatever. That was my Twitter. Um, I don't know. They didn't post anything about their March box or April, so I'm not sure what's going to happen with that. I may have to look for another subscription box for art. Uh, but in the meantime, I have um, the alcohol ink from December. I have the markers for sketching and doing manga characters that I still have to learn how to do that, but I did a pretty good elf last time. And I have these stuff now. So I have uh, several things to get busy with and uh, to play with for art. So I am excited and Next time on Twitch, I will be playing either Monster Hunter or GTA with my friends. That's going to be later today, so don't forget to tune in. I don't know. I kind of want to go play Monster Hunter right now. 
I have a lot to <clears throat> I have a lot to learn about that game. So I will show you my paintings pretty soon. I will work on something um, tomorrow with these items. I'm not sure what yet. Sometimes this stuff. Oh, hey, Sarah, how's it going? Yeah, the times are kind of weird here, but I was showing people what I got into, in, what I got in this little box for today. This month, I'm attacking myself with this. And I was telling everybody that um, I was gonna be playing games later. And, uh, but yeah, you pretty much, yeah, I know, time zone tragedy. But thank you for stopping by, I really appreciate that. Um, it seems like the channel has been doing a little bit better. I've been trying to Twitch every day, um, different times of the day as well, and it's been helping. I still don't get affiliated yet, but I think I have a feeling that's coming soon, so... I'm just gonna show you around real, really quick. I have some stuff over there that's, uh, that I made. That Medusa headpiece. So this is my chill living room. It's not as uh, well decorated as I wanted it to be, but I'm grateful for the furniture we have because it was given to us. I wanted to make the place look more goth, but it doesn't really matter. This looks kind of a, kind of like a Victorian-ish. Um, style with the furniture that I have. I need to change these. Oh my God. <laughs> ah, dying. My tripod, turn. Phone, turn. Flip around. <laughs> See what happens now when you're grabbing a clumsy tripod for your phone. Now I'm like upside down. So I want to change this thing here. It's too Western looking for me. Oriental, I don't know. I don't like the fringe, but Jesus. Thank you so much. And now I'm upside down. Great. Well, this is dying. Ah, <laughs> ah stop. Great. All right, guys, I am going to head out. I am going to get ready for some monster hunt action. I am not. I am on my phone. What the hell is going on? On my preview. That's really weird. Okay, whatever. <laughs> and if you are uh, on Xbox One, feel free to add me. My, my gamer tag is the same as my username here on Twitch. Yeah, the phone app is weird. I hope it doesn't look awful. Last time I did a broadcast with Keris, um, the resolution was horrible. It's still on my video list if you want to take a look at it, but it was just bad. I was like, oh, maybe it was because um, the connection was kind of funky and maybe it's going to reload and be good again, but it wasn't. So it was pretty bad. And hopefully this one is not as bad so I can share it on YouTube because I have a YouTube channel too that you, sh you should be subscribed to, guys. Um, it's been hard for me to work on content because of um, the lack of professional camera, but I'm trying to do my best with my phone. And it's been working, you know. I mean, I can do uh, certain things with my phone and um, I have a lot of stuff to show you guys and uh, there's gonna be a lot of content for Twitch and YouTube and Instagram and all the things. I can't wait for new cosplays. I have one already planned. Hopefully um, the shoot goes through the 12th of this month and I have another coming up as well. Uh, one is anime. It's a gory anime. So that's just the only hint I'm gonna give you. And as far as modeling goes, I'm continuing the El Fiori with my friend Kiris. And the themes that we have to do is Illusion, Garden, Eternal. And there's survival uh, post coming pretty soon. So stay tuned for that. And I am going to go put this stuff away and go play Monster Hunter. I will be on Twitch again 
5.30 p.m. Uh, Arizona time, because I am in Arizona. And if I can be on earlier, I will let you know, but follow my channel or follow my Twitter for updates. Bye. Yes, I'm sure.